The Valentine box contains three cake mixes, a stainless steel bowl, yummy icing, Valentine inspired candy cake decorations, and a fun Valentine toy for your tiny baker. I am so excited to be here with my granddaughters today. Where are we? At your house, but where are we in Arizona? No, we're in Utah. We and, moved. and it's cold. What's it doing outside today? It's snowing. It's snowing. And what did we do today? We to do today. We throw snowballs. We threw snowballs. We had a snowball fight. Yeah. Oh, he's trying to get dad, no? <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to set the box aside because we can use that for lots of other things. That's a good box. <laughs> we have vanilla and chocolate cake. And Eleanor, since it's your birthday, you get to pick first. Which cake do you want to mix? Chocolate? Okay. Okay, so each one of you get your bowl. Each one of you gets so your spatula, cute. and we have our decorations. Yeah, they're cute. And we have hey. icing, which is yum. <gasps> and of course, we have our Easy Bake Oven pan and our Easy Bake Oven. If you don't have an Easy Bake Oven or a pan, let us know if you need a pan. We'd be happy to add one to your order. And then once you have a pan, if you don't have an easy big oven, you don't have to go buy one and actually cook this in a regular oven, huh girls? At 350 degrees. So let's show you how easy this is. All you need is a bowl, something to mix it with, and do you remember the last thing we need, girls? Water. Hold that up, Grandma will put this in for you. So this is Mitty's vanilla cake mix. Oh, it's okay. So there, whoa, do you see that? It went up in the air, didn't it? Oh, it smells good. Does it? Mm. You smell chocolate. Whoa. Can I smell? I smell that. Mm. Is that good? Okay. And look, your chocolate even has little tiny chunks of chocolate in it. Oh. Mm. Mm. We just add two of these. Do you guys want to add it yourself? Yes. Ellen can go first. Ellen first. One. Make sure it's filled all the way. Two. two. <laughs> okay. Start mixing Make it. Make it. Ellen. Hold your bowl. Mix the cake so it doesn't flop out. Your turn. Two. That's two tablespoons. The chip. Yeah, it has little chocolate chippies oh. in it. Isn't that what you call it? Chocolate chippies? Mm hmm. I'm gonna name it chocolate chip. <laughs> you wanna name it chocolate chip instead of chocolate cake? Okay. Make sure your tiny bakers mix the cake batter well. It will be thick when you're done. This is about the consistency that you want. Don't forget to spray your pan. You want that tiny cake to come out easily. Here's the other thing you can do, Eleanor. Do you know how we get the air bubbles out of our tiny cake? No. We do this, ready? Watch everybody, it's really important. Oh. Can you do that a couple times? <laughs> it's chocolate. That's the, I know, that's the best part. One more time. Come on, All right. All right, here we go, girls. Time to bake. Now, if you're a tiny baker at home and you don't have an easy bake oven, you can bake this in your regular oven or a toaster oven at, do you remember how many degrees? And when I go so close, it's flat. 350 degrees. That's going to be really hot in another oven. So if you're going to do that, make sure you have help because we don't want any of our tiny bakers burned, right? We don't want anybody to get burned and get hurt. Okay, here we go. Time to bake our cake. 
This will take 17 minutes to bake. Make sure when you put the cake inside the Easy Bake Oven that both flaps are down. If one flap is up, it's like baking with your oven door open and it'll never bake. We have your vanilla cake ready to go, right? Uh -oh. What do we have in that? Pink and red. Pink and white little beads, right? Mm -hmm. And these are the what are we hearts. Hearts. Those white and purple and pink. Why do you think we have hearts in this box? Because it's almost Valentine's Day. It's almost Valentine's Day. Who's your know. Valentine that I know? Me? <laughs> I think she's favorite. You, you're a Valentine's Day card. Am I a Valentine's Day card? <laughs> Who's your Valentine? Do you want a Valentine in? No. Valentine is somebody you love a lot. Grandma! Who's your Valentine? A nail card. Who's your Valentine? Your nail Are you avoiding the subject? Who do you love, Eleanor? Me? Next up, <laughs> chocolate cake out. Let that cool down. Vanilla cake in. Like that. And we'll just come out push it. You guys want to have me push it? Push it all the way. And now we have it in the cooling chamber. Add more. Once your cake is totally cool, so you've got how many minutes in the cooling chamber? Remember? Yeah. Younger children typically need a little help with this next part. Once the cake has cooled for 10 minutes, loosen the edges with a spatula or a plastic knife. This will help it release from the pan. As you can see, the older the child, typically the more they can do by themselves. Did you know you can decorate twice as many cupcakes, cakes, and cookies with ease just by beating air into the frosting? And it makes it so much easier for your tiny baker to use. The more air you are going to make, the more yummier. Yes, the more yummier. What a good word, right? Wanna taste it now and see if it's yummy or Eleanor? Use your finger. Use your finger. Mmm. Is that more yummier? Okay. Place a small amount of icing under the cake. This acts like a glue and helps the cake stay in place while you decorate. Eleanor just turned four, <laughs> so we're gonna give her a little more help. This is a great time just to have fun and encourage your tiny baker. Now, Eleanor, this time I want you to hold the plate with one hand. I know you're right handed, so hold the plate with your left hand, hold it with this hand, and then try to get the icing to the corners and try to cover the whole cake so you don't see the chocolate. But you know what? If you see it, that's okay too. Because if you want tiny baker, you can just icing and decorate the top. You don't have to worry about the sides. Here we go, Valentine nonpareils and candy hearts. Did you know we provide you with holiday specific cake decorations that are cute and yummy? Is there anything more fun than seeing your tiny baker create this tiny little cake 
and then see them feel so happy about what they created? Mama, look. I made my own little cake. It's so good. Do you love it? Having fun while waiting for the cakes to bake is part of the experience. Okay, our cake has been in the cooling chamber for five minutes. We're gonna set it down and let it cool off about another five. We're gonna remove it from the pan and start decorating. Typically, the older the child, the less help they need. Let's see how she does. Don't you just love baking with your tiny ones? Let them have fun as you gently guide them how to be successful bakers. You are not just making cakes, you are making memories. Here we go. Let's see what she can do with the Valentine decorations. Uh-oh, Eleanor might be getting a sugar rush. We made two tiered cakes today, but you can make a single layer heart shaped cake or even a three tiered cake. 